15 covers the provinces of Kalinga, Apayao, and Cagayan. However, in 2010, due to its wide range and the continuous increase of members in the region and local centers multiplied to, it was agreed to be subdivided into two regions, namely Region 15, which covers Cagayan, and Region 15A, Kalinga, and Apayao. Later on, the term region was changed into the term district, hence the existence of District 2 covering the provinces of Kalinga and Apayao including some parts of Mountain Province. District 2 covers 7 areas which are the following. Area 1 is the eastern part of the book city. Area 2 is the central part of the book, Tinglayan, and some parts of Apayao. Area 3 is composed of Southern Tabuk, Tanudan, and some parts of Mountain Province. Area 3A is in Mountain Province. Area 4 is the Municipality of Pinokpok. Area 5 is the Municipality of Palbalan. And Area 6 is the Province of Apayao. In 1965, the late Hermano Apolonio Naval donated a land located at San Juan Tabuk City with an area of 155 square meters which is intended for the construction of a UECFI chapel. In 1988, the construction of Centro Philadelphia began with an initial budget of 87,000 pesos. This money were donations from UECFI members which was initiated by the late Hermano Bonnie Colliado who, at that time, was the regional president. Renovations and improvements were continuously done through the concerted efforts of spouses Hermano Bonicoliado and Hermano Janet. They also received donations from members of UECFI which were utilized during the chapel improvements and renovations. Central Philadelphia became the district center hence became the venue for big events of the district. Here are some major events that took place. The 2015 Leadership Training and Seminar Workshop of Region 15 and 15A, which was attended by national officers. The 2018 Mediumship Training attended by the Co-Chairman of Committee on Mediumship, Hermano Roy Pasamonte, President General Hermano Kennedy Aquino together with members from District 1. And the 2019 Roundtable Discussion on IRR and Legal Grounds in UECFI Baptism, which was attended by guest lecturers from Philippine Statistics Authority and Hermano Alex Agmayao, a solemnizing officer of UECFI and a retired postmaster. From then on, the District Center continuously serves as a place for spiritual sessions. However, early this year, the entrance of the chapel was demolished due to road right-of-way implemented by the government. Further, in 2020, a lot was purchased in Barangay Balong, Tabuk City, Kalinga for the relocation of the district center of District 2.